Hey guys, Sabrix, and guys, before the video starts, we're actually going to be doing a giveaway, guys, uh, when we reach 3,000 subscribers, and the thing we're going to be giving away is actually going to be something really, really cool, and that's, of course, going to be the Godzilla Playmates um, Gorosaurus, and this figure, guys, is really rare to find right now of time of this recording. So far, I only found once and, of course, one target. And that's of course pretty insane. I've been trying to look for this figure for a while. Finally found one and I'm actually going to give it away. I'm actually going to do that when we reach 3,000 subscribers. And that's of course something a pretty really cool giveaway. Most likely some of you will like. Um, but we don't know other stuff we might do later on in the future. But that's so far I have an idea right there. We're going to do a giveaway for the Gorosaurus. So when we reach 3,000 of course we're going to be giving it away. So hope you guys enjoy the video. Bye. Hey guys, Stanbricks and guys, finally we got the pictures of the new Jet Jaguar from Godzilla Singular Points. Um, point, I meant technically. But finally, this thing right here looks incredible. And we actually got some, of course, news of the price. And we also got the, of course, release date. And we sadly got another third thing right here. And that's, of course, this is going to be a web shop exclusive. So that's, of course, going to be a little bit annoying. Um, usually what that means. It's going to be a little bit more expensive than usual. So that's, of course, awesome right there. Um, it says right here the price is going to be 9,900 um, yen. Compare that to the U.S. mining. That's $87. So this figure is most likely going to cost around $87 up to $130 around there maybe. I'm just guessing around that part. Uh, I'm just trying to remember how much was um, Godzilla from of course Singular Point. That was I think around $115, $118 on Big Bad Toy Store. So I guess we will see. Uh, maybe this figure could actually be under $100. Maybe it could be around like $90 something, $107 or around there. Um, but I could be wrong. I'm just guessing on the price point right there. But usually, that's what usually Big Bad Toy Store and other websites um, raise the price a little bit because it's going to be a web shop exclusive. Usually that happens a lot. But the price around that much, is it worth it? I don't know. I would say maybe because how much accessories you get and just like how the figure looks to me. It's kind of funny because I used to hate the Jet Jaguar design until, of course, in the, in the show, technically, he did get different legs and he does a little bit more. Um, stuff in the show I thought he was not gonna do and it was actually pretty insane. So let's get started with the figure of course Here's of course the first picture you've been seeing for a little while um, Looks pretty cool. The detail looks insane. Um, really nice. And of course you can see the spear right here um, Really cool looking. Um, I'm actually really shocked it came with it and that's actually really awesome And the detail on it is pretty good. Hopefully the detail will look of course like this of course when we get it um, I'm really hoping but that's of course right here the picture for this one um, Here's of course a better picture of how the full figure looks like and it looks incredible the detail the painting looks really really good um, I love the head scope of course um, I love of course how the eyes look it looks like a light up feature but I could be wrong so far I haven't seen anything from that yet um, but that's of course right there the head looks pretty good the body looks good the paint looks good so this is of course amazing looking figure um, so yeah I can't wait for this one I most likely will get it because how good it looks and I remember in the show I enjoyed watching this character actually surprisingly so that's of course pictures right there and here we have another accessory that's actually shocking and here's of course the little helicopter piece right here for him if you have not seen the show of course give me some spoilers right here um but that's of course really cool right there how that uh, actually looks and it actually came with i'm actually really surprised um i'm wondering actually to know how it's going to be connected in the back i'm really interested to see how that's going to look um but it looks pretty good so that's really awesome um here's of course another picture right here of him running this actually looks a little bit weird i'm not gonna lie um um, pretty interesting how he's holding the spear and how he's running. I do not remember that, but that's pretty interesting. Here's another pose right here that actually looks really, really cool with the spear like that. Really awesome. Um, of course, you can see the joints right there for the figure. Pretty interesting, but I'm a little bit scared because these look breakable. Um, very, like, especially right here in the leg part. Wow, that looks so breakable. I'm actually really nervous about that now. I just noticed, especially right here. Wow. So I think that might be common with this figure, maybe some broken parts, um, but to be honest, um, we haven't really seen how the joints are going to work, or maybe they're going to be die cast. I don't know if any parts can be die cast. From seeing the pictures, I don't think so. I'm hoping maybe like the joints will be die cast, but so far from seeing, um, I don't think so. But that's, of course, a really cool pose right there. Um, here's, of course, another one right here of, of course, the helicopter piece. Here's, of course, a picture of the back. And pretty interesting, if you haven't seen, is that's going to come with one of the little figures right here. Forgot the guy's name. I completely forgot. Something with Yun. Yun. I completely forgot. 
But it does come with that, of course, figure. But it's pretty interesting because how it looks and it's unpainted. Same thing as, of course, um, the Godzilla figure because it came with two little um, old, um, Jet Jaguars, I meant. Uh, little figures like that unpainted also. So this is pretty interesting comes with it. I guess, of course, if you want to paint it, you could do that. But the other thing is the pose looks really weird. Um, the only part doesn't look weird when it's actually sitting down, like right there. It actually looks okay, but that's, of course, pretty interesting. You can see more, of, the, of course, the detail right here in the back for the figure also. Um, these joints right here, pretty cool detail. More of the helicopter, of course, picture right here. Um, helicopter pieces. And, of course, that. And here's, of course, a cool shot right here with, of course, Jet Jaguar versus Godzilla. And this is a really cool shot. So, of course, it is um, in scale with this figure. So, I'm going to say that makes no sense because in the show, he had those extra parts. But, technically, you could just do the, those parts with just that scene. You don't really need to put next to the um, Godzilla figure. So, it's technically separate. But, unless, of course, you're going to take off all the parts... Like, of course, the helicopter piece, the spear, you could technically still use it as, of course, the figure him fighting with Godzilla. Oh, I, I Godzilla, I meant. But that's really cool, of course. This shot right here looks incredible. From seeing, I'm kind of shocked, unless he's, um, the angle just looking at it, because he does look tiny, Jet Jaguar. But he's also kneeing down a little bit, so I guess we will see how tall really is next to this figure. Um, I can't remember how tall was this Godzilla figure. I kind of forgot. Dang it, there was no actually or poor or like news thing about how tall this figure is that's pretty interesting i haven't seen that yet but i guess we'll see of course a little bit more later on right now um that's actually all the pictures right there that's kind of shocking i thought there were more but it's of course really cool shot right here um this figure does look really good but also of course really scary and of course price and of course maybe some of these joint parts parts right here so that's of course everything right there guys let me know down below your thoughts are you guys excited for this figure are you guys disappointed how it looks are you disappointed how much it is um i'm annoyed of course it's a web shop exclusive so um, that's of course gonna be I guess common now it's gonna be rare if they're not exclusives but that's of course my thoughts and everything hope you guys enjoyed today's video guys see you guys next time bye